a family was coming to an agent because their father had had a stroke a few months ago and they were gonna sell his property. So many requirements, right, for your clients, whether it's sellers, buyers. So when title has their requirements, we often get like big pushback and I get it. Nobody wants to go to their seller and ask, questions that are maybe are a little bit uncomfortable. However, there have been some really, really interesting files that we've encountered the last couple of weeks. And I want to give you guys an example. A family was coming to an agent because their father had had a stroke a few months ago and they were going to sell his property. And they had a trust, they had a power attorney, all the things they provided to us that we didn't even need, like a medical directive and all those things. So we're having management take a look and they start to ask some questions. And one of the things we look at, of course, is title as our due diligence is what? A signature, right? We compare a signature from, say, five years ago to a recent signature. All of these documents provided to us were completely forged. forged. So. We're assuming what happened was this gentleman had a stroke, became incapacitated, which we did get a letter from the VA confirming that he is incapacitated. And then after that happened, whomever in his family decided that they would make decisions on his behalf, which that's not how that yeah. worked. They were gonna... So that's why we ask a lot of questions. 